Hello and welcome back. This is Glenn again. This is going to be tacked right on to the last time. I'm going to do the third test, or the third lesson. And that is to pull off a sharp port. I was going to say left. Sharp turn to port. So I want to try it just really plainly the first time through. I'm going to back way off in the throttle. Like maybe even go backwards. Let's see. And see what our speed goes down to. So we were coming in at four knots. Just gonna look around the, the bow of the boat. And you know, it's a pretty narrow lane. And uh, it's worth pointing out we're using a different kind of boat this time. Looks like some kind of like bulk carrier or some kind of maybe a liquid natural gas thing. I'm not sure. Uh, that would be something to learn what kind of ship this is. But I think it looks like, reminds me of the kind that carry like uh, loose storage materials, or, or sorry, loose um, production materials and things like that. Sand and gravel and maybe greens, things like that. Maybe it's like a green kind of train. Okay, so I'm just going to head over and see how effective at this low speed hitting the rudder is. If I just try to keel it over. Let's see if it'll go or not. Uh, yeah, it's kind of moving, but not not a convincing amount. Here's what the ship looks like from the outside. It's beautiful. Look at that. This is what I love about this game. Just the, the feeling and the sounds of really being around uh, a big ship like that. Let's just see. I think I had it going back a little bit too much. I went to like reverse. I don't really need to go to reverse. I need to actually have the rudder. Let's not have that weird effect on the rudder. So let's make sure it's not... I think it was working against me just now. And let's also move the bow thruster, since we're going so slow, all over. And this should actually, I think, get us turned around. Look at that. We're actually easing right into it. So this is probably what they wanted us to do. I think this isn't so hard. Uh, this ship is somewhat more, more maneuverable, too, at that speed. So yeah, I mean, it looks like we're on a pretty good course here. We've got a, a pretty wide open space. Our rate of turn is at 32 degrees to the por to port right now. So it's going pretty fast for us. We're just going to speed it up a little bit so we actually get some momentum. We don't go too slow. Um, though maybe I don't want to do that. I do want to make sure the back of the... We want to make sure the stern doesn't poke through those those buoys there. Because that's the only thing to watch out for is just the back of the boat. I think that's probably the good thing about using the forward thrusters is you can then push the front of the boat um, and have it pivot at a much further point up the boat. I think that's the theory from when I was watching someone else's video. An instructional, like a, like a Mariner's video. And it looks like we're heading right into the end zone here, so to speak. Look at that rate of turn, 44 degrees, yeah. I mean, we're just totally pivoting over. So I think we probably did it perfectly almost the first time around, other than maybe being a little happy with the reversed thrusters action. But let's see, look at that beautiful, yeah, look at that. And I'm going to fit perfectly right through there. Wonderful. All right, and I'm just I'm just a little worried about the back of the ship now, over rotating. So let's see if I start going forward if that helps or exacerbates things too much. I can always mm. Mm. see if I can correct <laughs> for the other direction. Yep, that looks like that's working. Alright, so I think that's actually going to be 
be a successful test. But that's got me thinking, I wonder if I did that too cautiously. So what if I wasn't as cautious? What if I went in there and I said, you know what? The heck with it. I'm just going to like gun it around the corner. How fast could you go? I think I want to try the next couple tests, if you'll stay with me. Let's see what, let's push the limits to like how far you can push these ships and see whether it'll actually hold the line or whether that's like a bad idea and you're going to end up like a water skier or something flying all over the place. I'm really curious to see like what the, the properties are of these boats and how well they'll hold um, underneath. And as you can see, we actually completed that scenario. Success! You're the best around all right so i think with that in mind why don't we just try it again all right let's try it again now let's use the thrusters and let's see if we can really between the thrusters and judicious use of the speed regulation with the knowledge i don't want to go into full reverse let's try it again all right Briefing, take the turn, time left, 20 minutes, plenty of time. So I was saying, let's cut it to zero. Let's go ahead, get our bow open. There we go. There we go. All right, all right, all right. Let's try just with the bow thrusters. Because it looks like we got to watch the back of the boat in this area here now. Uh, yeah, it's still pretty narrow. Both sides, there's barely enough clearance. Uh, here we go. Cheating a little bit. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Ready. Set. Mm, all right, let's get her going. Mm, mm, all right, let's see what it turns like. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, see, our speed is still pretty good. Three knots. We're not out of control. Oh, yeah. Look, see, I bet you we could even gangster this thing a little bit. Let's do it. Yeah, come on. Mm, Cheat a little bit. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Let's do it. We're in a hurry. Gotta dump this stuff. Where can we send it? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Swinging around a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. All right. Slow down a little bit. Go a little crazy. Get that front turn around. Get that front turn around. Let's do it. Here we go. Here we go. Stay on target. Stay on target. Yeah, I see. There we go. I bet you we didn't even mess up. Yep. We're good. Here we go. Plenty of spirit. Full speed ahead. Let's see. Let's see if we can take it. Here we go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. A little. A little too much. A little too much. Got a little excited. A little big seat our turn there. There we go. Come uh, on. Come uh, on. Get the back over. Uh oh, I don't want to fail. Come on. Come uh, on. Come uh, on. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Oops. That's not good. It's <laughs> pretty good. Ooh. I can do it. <laughs> I can hack it. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, 
All right, all right. Uh, there we go. Maybe we'll swing over the button a little bit. Could have done that a little bit better. I think we should do it again. That was a little bit sloppy, but it was fun. There we go. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, straight around. There we go. There we go. Um, I don't, I don't want to go too far. Don't go too far. Why did I get cocky? Okay, again. Concentrate. Feel the power. Okay. I'm going along. I'm moving along. Can I keep this speed and do it? Good question. Can I sir? Bad Connery, sorry. All right, and see, last time I think I started cheating, and I didn't even need. Oh, it's going a little fast now. Yeah, nah. yeah, let's just slow her down. Don't panic. That's pretty cool. See, I'm trying to get the developers to let us get a little closer. Because I think it's more fun. Alright, and let's get the head back over and the front over. See what it can do for us. I'm actually going to slow it down. Let the front get a little more of a grip. Might even... Slow her down a little bit. But just turning should slow us down. Let's see. Just turning seems to do a pretty good job. I mean, I'm taking this thing seriously. I guess if I just messed around with the ships, I would learn this on my own. But I kind of wanted to approach this like it was a real sailor's tool. And if that means I do boring stuff a little bit. It's not really boring, though. It's fun. It's challenging. So I, I do recommend anybody that finds this interesting. See? I'm already going too far. All right, gotta go backwards. Zzz, slow her down. Drifting too far. Can't make that turn at too fast a speed. But this is the fun part, and this is the fun part about sharing it, I guess. You know, because it's not <laughs> making me any money that I know of. Um, but it is fun kind of like doing it and then having you guys watch it. Having you folks out there, I should say. Oh. People of all shapes and sizes and whatever. Welcome. Glad you also like boats. I like boats too. We both like boats. I think we'll do good. All right, going a little too slow now. Let's give it purchase. I don't want to back out of the zone. Oh, see. Engine has a little bit of. Mm, almost went backwards. Let's see. No, the front's doing fine. Front's doing excellent. Front's going too fine. Look at that turn radius. Jeez. Yeah, we can get a little purchase here. Let's get some purchase of the water. I need purchase. Purchase of the water. Wait. All right. That's another bad voice. Sorry. Here we go. Going slow. To and fro. Off we go. All right, that was much better. Didn't get cocky this time. Try gangster it. As a matter of fact, I'm even going to correct my course a little bit because 
I'm turning a little bit faster than I want to be. There we go. Thank you. That's okay. Maintain that turn rate. Success. There we go, victory. Boom, there we go, let's go off to the mission. Let's do it. See, that's what I want next, I want like a mission mode. Where's the campaign? Let's deliver some stuff. Let's get across the ocean. Let's do it. There we go. Full speed ahead. Almost. Feels good. Sound effects are good. I like it. All right, that was much easier. Getting a little better. All right, well, I'm gonna do a little review to see what I was supposed to learn, but except for that, thank you for watching this part with me. Let's see what we were supposed to learn. Okay, well that, that explains the whole part about what was going so weird when we were trying to back up the boat. And I was backing it up too much and it was doing like weird converse stuff with the maneuver. Uh, that makes sense. Just goes to show you can't do too much severe maneuvers if you really want to keep control. And let's see what else. Uh, yep, not good for the engine. Awesome picture, by the way. Um, push it to a home, make sure you're going to past. Mass on inertia. And so it says that in general you gotta watch how fast you're going. That makes sense. It's just a massive ship, it just takes too long. Too complete. Um, yep, just another reminder that you normally don't want to redline the engine either direction. Probably. Let's see. Alright, we did scenario three. Yeah, we did. We ended up further. It's not turn with the car, flow with the water, it takes a turn for the cardboard. It's just pointing out that you're not going like more <laughs> That's not how you're going. That's how you're really going. You're doing like a like a skid around the corner. Um, you know, like a like a someone on a water ski almost. Except the rest of the boat is the water ski, I guess. And that's a firm I guess the metaphor doesn't totally work, but it's interesting to think of it. Do not go too fast, but boom, boom, should be sideways for a while. <sighs> Reduce your speed before you start making a turn. Okay, so that was a mistake. Reduce your speed before you start making a tight turn so that you do not run wide, which is exactly what happened. I mean, if you look at this replay, the replay of it, you can see where I just, as soon as I started burning too fast, the turn, the turn totally just would have held center, and I, instead of doing this, I was like, Bruh way over there so yeah that's not cool do not go too fast you're into turn in time before you reach the point you must turn around yeah anticipate the turn stop turning in time that was also another problem or another thing we saw yeah definitely oh.